Visual Basic Note 9 2012. Today we see this tutorial picture box load, picture box image. What is the difference between this tutorial? Only for beginners, those who don't have any knowledge about any programming language, even C program and application program, any application program. Only this is useful for those who are want to easily approach the any application, application oriented based. Some development they want to do, they can use the VB.net. So they are a target audience for this tutorial. Suppose I want to start the Visual Basic. Here Visual Basic is there. I will start the Visual Basic like that. New project. In the new project there is in VB actually Visual uh, Visual Studio 2012. Visual Basic is there. Other languages if you click Visual C C C Sharp and or the she ash and c plus plus sql server or f plus is f slash is better i want only visual basic so i will click visual basic and i will click windows home application this is the name of the project i will click it once you click ok it will give form form. you can see here this is form design coming property you can see the property here you can see form design here you can see server explorer. This is called solution explorer. The next, next tutorial we can study what is the purpose of solution explorer, server explorer, how to use that we see. Just today we see very light things up. So first I want to save my phone. How I want to save? Save all. Better give save all. I have already YouTube this one. I will go here in the D colon. I can click. Apply with others YouTube tutorials. This is what my this uh, this is my folder where I want to save all my projects. Select folder. Here I see. I want to give the project name as picture. I give an picture. Save. Now you can see how it will save at me. You can see YouTube tutorial. You can see picture box. In the picture box, you can see there is another folder. This folder, you can see this is your project. This is form one. By default, form one design and form one. Always you have a practice to save. Save all. Don't save form alone. Here you see. Save all. Save form one. Same open file type like that. Better save. Save all. Then only full complete project is available. This is my form design. I want to go to toolbox. I will check where is picture box. Here I will check the picture box. I will place the picture box. This is the way I will show the picture box. If I click right click it, the picture box, properties will come. In the property always, the border style you can see, this is what, none. Why it is none? If you run run the form, this is runtime. This is runtime, this is called design time. See, design. This is runtime. If runtime is there, it color comes. Can you see the picture box? Oh, no. That's why what we do is the property sheet go and change property style as what well, always. Now you can you can see where the picture box is available in the runtime. So now what I will do is I want to suppose write a code. If double click it, automatically this will come. Whenever I click automatically, it will come. Now what I will do is I'll give picture box automatically. Picture box one is coming. Whatever I created, it will come as a tool. It will come as a picture box. Dot. I'll say size mode. Size mode is which size my picture should be here. Maybe auto size, center image, normal, sketch image. Too. Another tutorial will take what is the difference between all five. Now I will take what is the difference between load and image only. So now I will take only the uh, zoom image. Now I take zoom. Then I will do picture box one dot load is equal to equal to I give equal to not equal to it is a function. That's why it is giving like that. So dot load. You put load it is a function. In the in between function what parameter I want to say it is saying now I'll go which picture I want to uh, store is nothing but I'll have the pictures here. I'll go here. I'll take uh, do. 
whether I will take one do click here. So what I will do is I will right click this picture, go to property sheet, then I will take all my uh, address, address of this picture I will take. So I will copy, then I will go here, what is the name of the picture? Dot close double quotes. Here also start with double quotes, then double quotes. Now what I will do, I will just start. Yeah. Click where I write. So this is my one time. This is a one method of loading the picture. What is the second method? Now I will go there. Second picture box I will place it. Here you can see this is picture box 2. How I know this is picture box 2? You can see property sheet. Picture box 2 is coming. Here I can view picture image. Picture box 2 is. Here I will view. This is has uh, none. Border style is none. What I will give is border style is equal to um, this. This I will give. I will put this on. This is my picture box. Suppose the toolbox is not appearing. What we do? Go to view and take toolbar and toolbox. Automatically comes. But it's another method. If toolbox is not appearing. So this is a 3D method. How I write this toolbar is. That is my project here. My project is, I already told, VB picture box is the project name. This is what my project name. Here also you can see VB, I already given here. VB, this is close, I close already. So this is my project name. Right click it. Go to property. In the property, go to resources. In the resources, go to add resources. Add existing. I'll go to the picture. I will, I want to add the images. So what I will do is, I will add painting, one picture. Again, I will go and add another picture. This one. Now it's okay. Now again, I will come to the view. This picture box, click what I will write is, picture box 2, automatically come in picture box 2 dot image is equal to what I write is m my my that is this one my this is about resources my resources dot automatically how many in the uh, resources I add two things so now I will add this level now I will if I click this this is coming if I click this, this here I am not giving any more that's why it is in auto type what I do is here I will do and I will give the picture size also here. Picture, whatever it may be, picture box 2. Dot size mode. First one I given zoom in. So now I will give picture box. Um, I will give sketch image. Now I will give sketch image. Suppose. I will delete one thing. This image I delete. Think that I'll go to the resource. See here, I'll go to the resource again. Property. Resources again. I will delete painting. I'll delete otherwise. I'll delete this picture. I'll delete this picture. Now only one picture is available. Correct. Now I go to the design. I'll run. Error is because that picture is not available. So now what I do is, I'll go to the picture box 1. Now this is the error message. The error is coming this way of, is not, you see, is not a mem member of the resource. Now what is a member of the resource? Automatically giving, you see, empty So I'll put empty. I'll put empty. Now I'll put it. You see. So, now I will do save one. What is the difference between why we are doing this? Sometimes we are uh, my in this laptop. I have see colon this picture, another place, another picture, another uh, URL location. Suppose URL location change, there is no problem at all for this picture. Which one? If I use the image method, because it is available in where this was I added, so automatically I will get it. But that is not a problem. There is full part. 
Suppose by mistake one part I missed it, or I am not giving correct meaning, correct spelling mistake something here. That's all are beginners. They don't know anything with spelling mistake or anything they missed. It gives the error. Here no. Just adding, clicking the button. This easy way we can do the notes. This is the difference between the uh, two method. How to do the picture box using load and image. Method. So now I will copy this coding. Whatever the coding here, I will copy this coding here to this uh, one. So we can see the coding part. How the coding part is available here. So I can see the coding part. We can see the coding part very easily. What is a picture box coding? So it is useful whenever I will load the upload the file. So this way we can use the coding part. This is my runtime and the box. Runtime and the picture box. This is a runtime view of the box. 